Hi YouTube, it's me April and today I want to give my first impression slash review on the Easy Detangler brush. So if you're interested in that, please stay tuned. Okay, so quickly some uh, little facts about the brush. Um, I paid $14.95 for it. I ordered it on November 3rd. It shipped November 7th and I got it on yesterday, November 20th. So I was very excited to try it out today um, when I washed my hair. So quickly, let's get into it. Um, I was very excited because I was already using a brush similar to this with the fact that there are um, kind of like individual rows of teeth where you can kind of like get in here and it's very easy to clean. So I was already using a brush similar to that and I wanted to try this out because it was getting a lot of good reviews and a couple of the teeth on my other brush had broken. It's kind of like starting to snag on my hair. So I wanted to get a new brush so I figured this is the perfect time to try this out. So my reviews on it. In terms of the actual detangling, I will insert a video here. I'm going to be doing a live demonstration with this detangling brush. I literally just got it in the mail yesterday and you and I both will be seeing how this works on my hair because I have not used this yet. So I'm gonna start with this section that I always start with and give it a fair try. I have conditioner in my hair and um, it's actually this that I'm about to wash out. But anyway, we shall see how this goes, both you and I. It's safe to do vertical first, and then proceed to do horizontal. Ignore the shade. That's normal, but let's see how this goes. Wait, let me try what they actually say to do. It says to go vertical first, then go horizontal. See if I have a way that I do mine, I want you to see how this goes. It's getting a little slippery, but we are getting through here. It does feel nice. I'm gonna finally through. Okay, for those of you who may have been finding that, that was about one minute or one fourth of my hair to be detangled. I do like the amount of time it took to detangle. So I do wash my hair in four sections. As you wow, my hair is still wet. <laughs> um, I have four uh basically like plaits here or whatever you want to call it, twists. I detang I wash my hair in four sections and I air dry my hair in four sections. So it only took me for the longest um, detangling section. It took me probably two and a half minutes, three if I'm trying to be like really conservative. But the least amount of time it took me, I believe, was this section. Um, and it took about a minute and a half. So I really can't knock it like for, to be able to detangle one section of my hair in a minute and a half to three minutes, if you wanna say 12 minutes for my whole head, but I'm pretty sure it didn't take that long. That's pretty awesome for a brush. So overall, I do really like this brush. I actually love to, if you can see here, it's kind of curved, so when you actually brush your hair, it fits nicely and it actually does feel really nice, the teeth on the scalp. The only con that I have on it is that it feels like you're gonna be able to grip the brush really well here, but I'm telling you, once conditioner gets on that, it is pretty slippery. Like there's no, there's nothing to like stop your hand from going all the way down the brush. So after a while, I did get a cramp in my hand, but whatever, you know, in terms of comfort and the amount of time it took to detangle my hair with this brush, I will give it a B plus. And that's mainly because of the cramp that I got in my hand from, like I said, once this gets pretty sip, slippery with conditioner, it's gonna, it's gonna impede your workflow process because you're like constantly gonna be having to um, reposition your hand here or kind of like stretch your fingers out from the cramp that you're getting. But like I said, overall, this brush 
is a pretty awesome detangling brush, especially if you're moving from traditional paddle brushes or wide tooth combs or whatever. This is gonna be a major upgrade for your detangling process, okay? I'm kind of like a really, you know, I guess very critical reviewer because I all I already have um, a very popular brush. Um, I'll just go ahead and say I already have the um, Felicia Leatherwood detangling brush, which I love, and I also have a Denman brush. So you know, I'm I'm a I'm a pretty good critic because I'm coming from two very very good brushes. But again, this is a good buy. I would recommend it. It does decrease the detangling time. So I just wanted to get in here and <laughs> let you know my thoughts on the brush, okay? So have a blessed day, guys. Bye.